If you want to activate your full page extension for WordPress for Elementor, this is your video. Let's go to Elementor and then to full page for Elementor. This is the screen where we'll be able to see the state of our full page plugin in WordPress. We can now see that our plugin has been activated and if we scroll down a bit, we'll see the extensions that we have available. We can see that we have installed a couple of them and now we want to install a new one. Let's say that I want to install the scroll horizontally extension. All I have to do is paste the license key that I got on the purchase confirmation and then click on install extension. After a few seconds, we'll get the notification telling us that the extension has successfully been installed. Now all we have to do is activate the extension. Just be careful because once the extension has been activated for a specific domain, there's no way to deactivate the extension for that domain again. So please make sure to first try the extension before activating it for any domain to make sure that you really are interested in the extension and to make sure that it works for your specific use case. Once you are completely sure that you are going to use the activation for your domain, click on activate extension. This will bring us to the activation page. In here, we'll see that our license key has been introduced for us as well as our domain name. And all we have to do is confirm that we want to activate the extension for our domain. Finally, we click on get activation key. Now you'll see that a dialog box appears showing us our activation key. If you are using the WordPress plugin for Elementor or for Gutenberg, then you don't actually have to use this activation key. The plugin will automatically add this key for you. Now, if we go back to the WordPress panel, we can now click on check activation to verify that the extension has been successfully activated and it becomes green if everything went all right. So there you go. This is the way that you activate and install an extension for your plugin for Elementor. Now it's time to enjoy your extensions.